Hello, beautiful beings. Welcome to the fourth and final meditation of the Let Your Light Lead meditation journey. In this fourth practice, we'll be focusing on the Bliss Body Scan. So this is a meditation that you're gonna be doing laying down. So either roll out that yoga mat or get comfortable on the bed, laying flat or laying flat on the couch. Comfort is one of the primary focuses of this particular practice. So if you need a blanket, feel free to put a blanket over you or a pillow behind your head. So this, this particular body scan I created is a hybrid between the body scan of mindfulness-based stress reduction, uh, the mindfulness-based program created by John Kabat-Zinn, and Yoga Nidra. And Yoga Nidra is that ancient yogic practice of yogic sleep. And so it's a hybrid between the two because we're getting into the body. I'll be guiding you into the body using various body parts to focus on. And then we'll be expanding out of the body using some energetic language and really using the energy of our body to create again that compassion, that love in the heart space. So, you know, as we journey into the body, you'll notice things that arise. You might notice your mind wandering when we're at various body parts or body regions. Again, no judgment of self. Total acceptance, curiosity, and compassion for whatever arises and for whatever is happening in the mind and body. And this Bliss Body Scan is created to really get you beneath those ripples of stress, anxiety, depression, and fear getting you to feel more whole than being identified with one of those, stress, anxiety, fear, depression, and really allowing you to feel like you are expansive, you are whole, it taps into your natural source of health and healing, of well-being, and really bringing your mind, body, and spirit back to a space of homeostasis, of balance. The Bliss Body Scan is such a powerful and beautiful practice to help you bring yourself back home to that place of health within. So I recommend that you do this actually every night because it's so powerful for sleep. So it helps you sleep better, it can help insomnia, it can help chronic pain, it can boost your immune system. It really is such a powerful transformative practice. I use my own Bliss Body Scan all the time, almost every day. So prepare yourself by laying down, and I'll give you a few seconds to settle in here. So again, laying down flat on your back if you need uh, a blanket behind your knees in order to help ease any pain in your lower back, please do that. And just begin to relax and settle in. When do you have time during the day to just let go? And again, your mind's gonna wander. You might even notice that your mind will wander away from my voice and then it'll come back to my voice. That's a very common phenomenon in uh, the Bliss Body Scan because you're getting into that state between wakefulness and being asleep. So that's that sweet spot of restfulness in between being fully awake and being asleep. So just settle in. coming into your breath. And we'll begin the bliss body scan with three chimes of the heart chakra crystal bowl. And again, we'll end with three chimes of the crystal bowl. When you're ready, really allowing the eyelids to become heavy and to close. allowing your body to feel heavy. Sinking back into wherever your body is laying in this moment.
as you begin embodying stillness and silence, some of our wisest teachers sense into that rhythmic flow of breath, floating in and out of this body, your body that houses your mind, your emotions, your spirit. Your mind and body work tirelessly every day to keep itself alive, safe, comfortable. A tremendous amount of effort is expended in order to simply just be okay. So as you surrender into gravity for this yoga nidra body scan, this bliss body scan, You give yourself a gift of healing. So with each and every breath, surrender a bit more. Let go a bit more. No effort is needed. creating space for whatever arises in the spectrum of your consciousness. All thoughts, feelings, and body sensations are welcome. No judgment, but rather an untethered love and passion for who it is you are in this life. Now, bringing your mind to your life's intention, that sacred Sankalpa that we excavated when we practice the power of presence. What is your heart's deepest desire? What do you seek to create more of in your life? allowing that intention to arise from deep within, repeating it internally as your life's mantra. Creating this inner sanctuary through intention And as you lie there, letting go, surrendering, sense that floor, the earth, the couch, 
rising up to support the weight of your entire body. To support you as you journey ahead on this path of life. Now bring your awareness to the crown of your head, perhaps sensing tingling or warmth there at the crown, the crown chakra, your connection to your highest self, your connection to divine messaging. Sense into the forehead, releasing the brow point. Sense the globes of the eyes, both left and right, resting behind heavy eyelids. Sensing the nose, cheekbones left and right. Sensing lips, perhaps slightly parted, or even in a half Buddha smile. Sensing the tongue resting in the floor of the mouth. The sensation of the tongue touching the teeth. Now sensing into the left shoulder melting back into the floor, the cushion, melting back. Sense into the left arm, upper arm, elbow, forearm, the left wrist, Sensing into the left hand, back of the left hand, the left palm, the left fingers. Sensing radiant shimmering energy surrounding the left hand, radiating between the left fingers. And perhaps you can connect with a seed of gratitude for this left hand, this hand that allows you to write, touch, pick things up that you need. Breathing down the entire left arm. Now sensing into the left side of the chest, the left side of the heart chakra, and allowing the breath to travel from the left side of the heart chakra down into the abdomen, the belly. And sensing the breath movement like waves rolling in and out on a beach as the belly gently rises and falls. Sensing into that movement of vitality here in the left side of the abdomen. And 
sensing into the left hip, radiating breath down into that left hip, sensing the left glute, the upper left leg, breathing down through the quad and the hamstring into the left knee, this knee made of ligaments and tendons, bone, this knee that allows us to be mobile, to walk or run from place to place. Breathing through the left knee to sense into the left shin, the left calf, sending breath down through the left ankle, all the way to the left foot, sensing the top of the left foot, the sole of the left foot, Sensing the pinky toe of the left foot, the middle toe, the big toe. Feeling energy pulsing through this left foot, vibrating around the left foot. And perhaps a sense of gratitude for this left foot that kisses the earth each and every day as we move from place to place. But we so mindlessly forget how this foot serves us. Now inhaling through the left sole, all the way to the crown of the head, and exhaling down the entire right side of the body. And inhaling through the right sole, all the way up the right side of the body to the crown of the head, exhaling all the way down the left side of the body. No separation between left and right sides of the body. Now sensing into the right shoulder, melting back into the mat, the cushion, letting go, no tension, no stress here in the right shoulder. Sensing the right arm, upper arm, elbow, forearm, the right wrist. Sensing that right hand, the back of the right hand, the palm of the right hand. Radiant, shimmering energy swirling around the right, between right fingers. 
is it possible for you to connect with a seed of gratitude for this right hand, allowing you to write and type, to touch and carry items you need from place to place. That magnificent tool of the right hand. And as you breathe prana into the lungs, sensing that right side of the heart space, this region of the body where we give and receive love and compassion and caring with each breath inviting the full blossoming of this heart chakra particularly on this right side allowing breath to trickle into the right side of the abdomen. And through the portal of stillness, sensing that rhythm of breath floating through the abdomen, awakening this birthplace of our intuition, our inner GPS system. Radiating prana breath into the right hip, the right glute, sensing into the upper right leg, sensing the muscles of the quad, the hamstring. Breathing down into the right knee, made of ligaments and tendons and bone. This knee that generates so much mobility for our bodies to move about. Breathing into the shin. the right calf, the right ankle, sending healing prana, fullness of breath down the entire right side of the body, into the right foot, Sensing the top of the right foot, the sole of the right foot, the right pinky toe, middle toe, big toe. Sensing into gratitude and appreciation for this right foot that kisses the earth as you move about your life. Sensing shining, shimmering energy surrounding this right foot. Inhaling deeply through the sole of the right foot all the way to the crown of the head. Exhaling down the entire left side of the body. Through the left sole. And inhaling prana through the left sole. All the way to the crown of the head. Sending this healing prana down 
through the right side of the body to the right soul. Now inhaling both, both left and right soles of the feet, taking in healing, nourishing prana from both left and right soles to the crown of the head, opening all channels of the body simultaneously. And then exhaling, radiating, healing, breath and prana down all channels of the body to the soles of the feet. Sensing no separation between left and right sides of the body. Sensing no separation between the radiant healing energy and light that flows through the body and the radiating energy and light that surrounds the physical body. Each and every breath connecting with collective consciousness As we breathe, keeping our vessel alive, we can breathe knowing all of the beings of the world breathe to keep their vessels alive and vital. Each breath sinking back into the ocean of your consciousness. Each breath guiding you back home to that fertile ground of your wholeness that fertile ground of your being, reclaiming your truth, the truth of who it is you are, thriving beneath layers of stress, anxiety, depression, and fear. Are the unending bliss, an ocean of bliss. The radiant light of your being, your existence flows through you now and radiates into the world. Surrender to this light. Feel this light flooding through you, a golden healing light. bringing you back home to balance, to vitality, to abundance. Back home to the heart of humanity that lives within each and every one of us. You are an instrument of light.
again, bringing some gentle movement into your fingers and toes. Some gentle stretches. Some softness as you begin awakening the physical body. No hurry needed. And when you hear the soul's soft whisper, when you're ready to shift, rolling over to your right side and pausing there, Taking a moment to rest. Your precious body lying there on the right side. Cultivating pause. And whenever it is you are called, pushing yourself up gently to seated position, facing me. Gently bringing your hands to heart center in Anjali Mudra, prayer at the heart, sealing your bliss body scan practice with one ancient healing tone of all. Inhale. Congratulations, you've just completed the full journey of the Let Your Light Lead meditation series. I am so grateful you took this journey with me. And I wholeheartedly encourage you to utilize all of these practices in your daily life. The power of presence meditation the awakened lotus of the heart meditation, all of the practices of the art of releasing fear, and the bliss body scan. I created these practices from deep within my heart and my soul in order to deliver them to you and for you to begin living your own best life, for you to begin living in the fullest expression of who it is you are. If you'd like to deepen your healing process, I extend a warm invite for you to explore more on lenafranklin.com. Namaste.